Hi guys, today I am going to discuss about the one of the most important feature of Java 8 which is Lambda Expression. So let's create a project. Uh, I have the already created a project and uh, I would create a class uh, like uh, Lambda Expression. Here I can create now i would have shortcut control space main method so before going to discuss about the lambda expression i would uh, like to discuss about the functional interface actually uh, lambda expression is only applicable for the functional interface so what is actually mean in the functional interfaces so let's create an interface a and uh, i would declare a method like a public void display i have declared a method so uh, java 8 has provided a one of the uh, annotation called as func functional interface like as override annotation uh, they have provided this annotation as functional interface to verify the particular interface is a functional interface or not so let's create uh, or de uh, declare the new method public void so now it would give an error like what is the error invalid functional interface annotation uh, a is not a functional interface right if i would comment it now error would be removed so it means that there are two exactly method inside there are two abstract method inside this interface that's why it's giving an error if i would remove it then it would remove the error it means that functional interface is that which has exactly the one abstract method inside the interface is known as the functional interface and uh, the lambda expression is only used for the functional interface so let's uh, create a scenario why we need the lambda expression suppose i have an interface a right and uh, an declared a method public void display and suppose that I want to implement this interface into the class B implements A. Now I have to override this method display. Now I would give the body like uh, as well control space. I am in class B like that so I would call like a a equals to new b I can write in this way and a dot display I will call the display method of class b control f11 and I am in class b it's this printed and what is the another uh, approach to do this thing so I can remove the class B from here now I want to give the body of display here so this is the uh, using the anonymous class like that I can give this public void display and uh, we are giving the body of display this I am in anonymous class like that and here is the termination and uh, this is giving because a is the interface so this is the anonymous class and i have given the body of the display 
inside it so i'm calling the display so it would call this one f11 now it would print i'm in anonymous class right so the another way to do this is the lambda expression so how can i change into the lambda expression firstly i would remove this and uh, as you know that only the uh, one method inside this interface so we can also remove it like method name we don't require it and uh, this is not also required go here go here and uh, put the lambda expression symbol that's it it's not giving any error like f11 it is giving <laughs> you can change your uh, i mean lambda class like this so uh, the another thing is also that we can have the parameterized a method here so in a so this indicates that uh, you know, as earlier we have uh, override the display method so that would be the argument of that met method like int a we can give here or like t any any name we can give here and uh, we would pass like six and it would go from here to here and this is the body of the display method so we can use this t like here t like way f11 and here goes and similarly if uh, we already know that this is the only int one method inside it and uh, this isn't then why we are writing this we can remove this also like this and uh, for the one line we can remove this one too If we have a multiple line then uh, we would put the curly braces then we would use for the multiple line like this second SOP you can write second SOP like this clear and uh, like uh, suppose that uh, uh, we have only the one argument is here uh, this one suppose we have only the one argument here so we can also remove this two no problem at all here and uh, suppose we have two argument here in b we can use like t comma s we can print s here uh, okay nice what is the error here six nine six nine it was all about the lambda expression uh, thank you